we will be trying to find under Pants Pat a new home. So we were wondering if you could provide him with a home, the respect, the dignity, and sensitivity it takes to have a little plastic doll, maybe, you know, sitting in your car with you as you drive down. Here we are with the guy we met on the internet. He still won't tell us what his name is, but he's offered you a new home. He seems pretty excited. Does gay, does that mean that he's just happy? <laughs> Well, Underpants Pat, you barely escaped that crazy internet man in Chapter 4. Gosh, you were almost blended. It seems like finding a new home is going to be harder than we thought. Perhaps you should concentrate on finding a new career instead, so that you might support yourself. I was thinking, you might make a good graphic designer, college professor, or a media consultant. But Underpants, I like you to choose a career that appeals to you. Any thoughts on what you like to be? Faster than a cheap special effect. Not quite as powerful as other more manly dolls found in most retail outlets. Able to leap something when thrown. Look, up in the sky. It's a plane. It's a bird. It's... Power Pants Pat. Yes, it's Power Pants Pat. Queer visitor from another planet who is able to harass most mortal men. Power Pants Pat, who can't change even the course of his own life. Who can bend his arms with someone else's bare hands. And who, disguised as Underpants Pat, mild-mannered tool of embarrassment for the last several weeks, fights a never-ending battle for truth, justice, and the American way.